Hi everyone, I'm Miss Katie from Rockland Public Library and welcome to Rockin' Storytime. It is very windy today, so if you hear any noises, it's the wind. Let's start off by clapping our hands. <laughs> We're gonna clap our hands together. Can you clap along at home? Here we go. We clap and sing hello. We clap and sing hello. To all our friends at story time, we clap and sing hello. Great job, everyone. Now we're gonna stomp our feet. I know you can't see my feet, but here are my knees. One, two, here we go, ready? We stomp and sing hello. We stomp and sing hello. To all our friends at story time, we stomp and sing hello. <laughs> Great job, everyone. Welcome, welcome. Today, we are going to be reading books about how we are all different from one another. And another word for being different from one another is the word unique. Can you say that word? That's a fun word, unique. Unique, I thought that might be our word for the day, unique. Can you give that a try at home? Unique. We'll use that for bread and butter. So we're gonna clap our hands and clap our knees. Clap our hands, clap our knees. Here we go. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say unique as fast as we can. Unique, 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 unique. unique. <laughs> that's kind of tricky. Ready? Unique, 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 unique. Oh, that's hard. How are you doing at home? Unique, 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 unique. Oh, that's a really tricky one. All right, let's do another one. Here we go. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say unique as slowly as we can. Unique. Oh, that was good. Let's try that again. Unique. Great job, everyone. Let's do another. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say unique as loud as we can. Unique. Great job, one more. Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say unique as quiet as we can. Unique. Great job. Our first story about being unique and different from everyone else is called Bodies Are Cool by Tyler Fetter. Now this one I highly recommend. Henry and I read this all the time at our house. Bodies are cool. Big bodies, small bodies, dancing, playing, happy bodies. Look at all the different bodies. Bodies are cool. Lanky bodies, squat bodies, tall, short, wide, or narrow bodies, somewhere in the middle bodies. Bodies are cool. Can you see all the different people here? They have different shaped eyes, different hair, different skin color. We are all different from one another. Round bodies, muscled bodies, curvy curves and straight bodies, jiggly wiggly fat bodies, Bodies are cool. Can you see what these people are doing? I think they're in a dance class. Oh, what are these people doing together? They're painting, but what are they painting on, do you think? I think they're painting on the wall. Maybe they're making a mural. Dark skin, olive skin, every shade of brown skin, pinky pale or peach skin. Bodies are cool. Puffy hair, wavy hair, springy curls and flat hair, lots of hair or no hair. Bodies are cool. Can you see here in this picture? Every person has a pet with them today. And each person has a pet that matches their hair. Look, this child has some patches and so does the dog. Some curly hair. Some long hair here, fluffy hair. And if you see, everyone has a dog except this person here. Since they're in a wheelchair, they have a bird. Leg hair, armpit hair, fuzzy lip and chin hair, brows meet in the middle hair, 
bodies are cool. We have hair all over ourselves, not just on our heads. I have hair I can see right here on my arm. I have some light hair between my eyebrows and some hair on my face. There's hair all over us. Hazel eyes, brown eyes, mono lid and round eyes, blind or wearing glasses eyes, bodies are cool. There they are, those people together. I think this person might not be able to see through their eyes. And we do more than just see through our eyes too, don't we? I can see this daddy here with his husband. I think he's crying, maybe even happy tears. I think this person might be crying happy tears too. We use our eyes to cry and to see and do lots of things. Crooked faces, bumped nose faces, flat nose, full lipped, gap tooth faces, stick out ears and thin lipped faces, bodies are cool. What are these people doing? I think they're at an orchard or maybe a farmer's market. What it talks about, we have different teeth from one another. We have different ears. Some of us have bigger ears or smaller ears, bigger noses or smaller noses. And we're all very different. You can see I have a tooth right here that kind of lays over the other teeth. We all have our own special things. Freckled bodies, dotted bodies, rosy patched and speckled bodies, dark skin swirled with light skinned bodies. Bodies are cool. Can you see what these people are doing? They're eating ice cream. Hairy fingers, wrinkly fingers, dimpled elbows, chubby fingers, wobbly arms, and stubby fingers. Bodies are cool. These people are working on crafts. You can see all kinds of people. Some people have less fingers than others. Some people have some hair on their arms. Look, this person here only has one of the arms that they were born with, and this one has some help so someone probably didn't have an arm here and so they have this help arm right here put on to help them pick up things soft tummies saggy tummies flat or sticky outie tummies any outies pregnant tummies bodies are cool what are these people doing they're at the pool. Thick legs, scrawny legs, knobby knees and long legs. Roll up to the table legs. Bodies are cool. What do you notice about all these legs? They're all different, aren't they? Look, here's another person that looks like they didn't have a full leg, so they have a helper leg right here. And look at this person. They're in some kind of wheelchair to get around. And it looks like it's their birthday today. Faint scars, bold scars, stripes from getting bigger scars, marks that tell a story scars. Bodies are cool. Does anyone at home have a scar? I have a scar right underneath my chin from falling when I was about your age. But we all have different scars from surgeries, from falling, maybe ones we're born with. This body, that body, his and her and their body. However you define your body, bodies are cool. Growing bodies, aging bodies, features rearranging bodies, magic ever-changing bodies, bodies are cool. Now what I like about this page is that these two pictures are the same people, but older. See, here's maybe a grandma and grandpa, and here they are a bit older. The kids are getting older. We all change as we grow. We get taller, but sometimes we, the way we look changes as we grow too. My body, your body, every different kind of body, all of them are good bodies. Bodies are cool. The end. Great listening, everyone. 
I thought we would do a couple of songs about our bodies here. So this one's kind of more of a chant, but it goes like this. This is me from head, can you find your head? From head to toes. I have two, oh, I have two eyes and a nose. I can clap my hands. Can you clap your hands? I can clap my hands. I can stomp my feet. Can you stomp your feet? From head to toes, I'm pretty neat. Let's try that again, are you ready? Here we go. This is me from head to toes. I have two eyes and a nose. I can clap my hands. I can stomp my feet. From head to toes. I'm pretty neat. <laughs> Great job, everyone. Now our second one is talking a little bit about feelings. One of the other things that we show on our faces or maybe we show in the way we're holding ourselves is how we feel. And that can be very different from other people around us. So it goes like this. I have feelings, you do too. Let's all sing about a few. I am happy. Can you look happy? I am happy. I am sad. You look sad. I am sad. That's right. I am scared. And I am mad. I am proud of being me. That's a feeling to you see. I have feelings, you do too. We just sang about a few. Good job, everyone. Let's try that one more time. Are you ready to do your, change your face into different feelings? Here we go. I have feelings, you do too. Let's all sing about a few. I am happy. I am sad. Oh, I am scared. And I am mad. I am proud of being me. That's a feeling to you see. I have feelings you do too. We just sang about a few. Great job, everyone. Let's see what our second and last story is today. This is called Wild About Us. Wild About Us by Karen Beaumont. Illustrated by Janet Stevens. Wild about us. I'm a warty warthog. Can't be who I'm not. I am who I am and I've got what I've got. I have tusks. I have warts, but I like what I see. In my own special way, I'm as cute as can be. Yes, sirree. We all are the way we are all meant to be. Look, <laughs> it even has a little fly on its nose. Crocodile's proud of his toothy grin. Rhino feels fine in her wrinkly skin. Oh, isn't she cute? Elephant's confident nothing is wrong. He knows that his nose is supposed to be long. We know that too, don't we? We all have different sizes and shapes for noses, but they're all perfect for us. No one laughs, says Giraffe, cause she's lanky and tall. Here at the zoo, there's room for us all. Would you dare tell Flamingo he couldn't be pink? Or a pot-bellied pig that she's too plump, do you think? We never tease Tortoise for being too slow. He's not meant to hurry or scurry, you know. Does Porcupine care that she can't curl her hair? What do you think, does she want to curl her hair? Is Leopard upset that he has spots everywhere? Some of us have spots too, don't we? We might have different colored skin. We might have moles. Look, I have a mole right here. We have different freckles and dots on our bodies. Hippo is happy. She loves her behind. It wiggles and jiggles. It's one of a kind. She's proud of precisely the way it's designed. Chimp's ears stick out. 
as you can certainly see. But he thinks they're charming and we all agree. That's something we have that are different too, right? Our ears. I have kind of small ears compared to some other people, but we all have different ears. Some are big, some are small, and they're all different kinds of shapes. Kangaroo has huge feet, but you don't see her pout. She has much better things to be thinking about. We're glad we're all different. It would be such a shame if you came to the zoo and we all looked the same. The end. Don't you think that's true? Animals are so cool because they all look different. And that's why we're so cool too. We wouldn't want all of us to look exactly the same. What's different about us makes us special. The end. All right, everyone, I think it's time for us to end with head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Can everyone find their head? Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose, boop, boop. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Great job, everyone. Should we do it a little faster? Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose, boop, boop. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Great job, everyone. Thank you for all coming today and head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, eyes and ears and mouth and nose and boob, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. <laughs> Thank you for all reading and singing with me today. And don't forget, we do have in-person story times on Tuesday and Wednesday at 1030 if you want to come. But if not, I hope you remember that what's different about you makes you special. Have a great day and see you next week. Bye-bye.